Hi guys and welcome to Drive Spark. I'm Promit and today we are going to witness three motorcycles. Now you must have heard of this brand name. Obviously everyone almost has heard this motorcycle brand name and that is Yesdi. From the 70s to the 90s, Yesdi motorcycle just absolutely ruled the market with the two stroke motorcycles, amazing build quality with amazing looking bikes and we are here now as you can see behind me we have three new yesdies so let me give you a quick walk around so that you can see how these three motorcycles now look so yeah guys these are the new yesd motorcycles and they look absolutely gorgeous now you can see you have an adventure motorcycle you have a scrambler and you have a roadster now let's start off with the roadster now you can see you get the yesd badging on the tank and you have a lot of modern equipments like you have an led headlamp over here now the indicators on this are not led a halogen and plus you can see this gets this alloy wheel with dual channel abs and dual disc brakes you can also see this is an oil cooled so on the front end you can see it looks absolutely fantastic and you can see that the mudguard has some stickering that looks amazing. You have some amount of chrome finish um, on this, like the side mirrors are finished in chrome. Plus you have a lot of chrome all around on this motorcycle. Now there will be a blacked out version of this motorcycle also. And I'm going to tell you a few things that are going to be optional or you can purchase them from the yes, the showroom. From the showroom. And uh, here you have the key fob. So this is for your ignition and this is the instrument cluster. Looks pretty modern so when you switch it on it says hi and there you go. So these people have kept, I mean the background is black and it's basically a negative uh, instrument cluster that is looking absolutely fantastic. Right now whatever you see on the bike is there is nothing aftermarket, brilliant looking motorcycles you can see that the, atten that the attention to detail is fantastic and you can see that the alloy wheels look absolutely gorgeous you have uh, the pea shooter exhaust looks similar like the ones that used to be back in the 70s 80s and 90s obviously those were two strokes this is four stroke and over here on the tank cap you get the ESD logo and it's been established in 1969 again you have some more details on the tank that look absolutely fantastic now you get a single piece seat looks like a single piece seat but i think you can remove this because this is not attached over here you can see that there's a gap looks like a single seat very comfortable seat very cushiony and you also get this backrest that comes as standard you also get this logo is here on most of the Parsi cars and bikes and just in case if you want this logo now this is finished in brass and it's giving a 3d effect and it is actually looking really nice so if you want this uh, aftermarket you can get the similar thing on either motorcycles it is just this logo is just present on the roadster and uh, there you go there you have the second disc with the abs so there is dual channel abs on this and the tank is a 12.5 liter tank now let us quickly come to the engine specifications so the roadster is powered by a 334 cc engine actually all motorcycles are powered by 334 cc engines but the power figures and the torque figures are different on each motorcycle so the roadster is powered by a 334 cc uh, single cylinder engine and uh, it produces 29.7 ps of power and 29 nm of peak torque there you go there you have the side panel and you have the roadster badging over there this is the engine cover and again you have a lot of chrome present here and there that makes the bike look absolutely fantastic these tank pads are amazing they will uh, keep your now basically they will pro protect your knee from brushing against the tank and they're pretty comfortable they're pretty soft so just coming to the price of this motorcycle now the roadster is priced at 1.98 lakh X showroom and it looks absolutely fantastic now you have a few color options present in the roadster as well and now quickly let's move on to this now this what you see here is the yesd scrambler now obviously it looks like a scrambler definitely because first of all the mudguard that's present over here 
and the straight seat, the knobby tires and obviously you have the scrambler badging over here. Now on the tank you have the legendary SD and you have this uh, decal present. You have the SD badging over here also and uh, you have a handlebar now you can see that the handlebar is different very different from uh, all the, I mean the handlebars are different on all three motorcycles because all three motorcycles are a separate type of motorcycle that's a roadster scrambler this is an adventure so let's come back to the scrambler and these knuckle guards are again an accessory accessory wise this is also an accessory the fly screen you see over here now this the headlight cover is an accessory and on this you get LED indicators and basically the entire lighting setup is LED there is, there is very less amount of chrome on this motorcycle and again you get dual channel ABS with a dual disc and this has ride modes there is rain off-road and normal so this is how the cluster is and again uh, the cluster is slightly mounted towards the right hand side and the key fob is uh, right at the center so this gives a very retro feel like earlier days the speedometer or the cluster was slightly towards the right and over here you see this is the USB charging socket now it has a type C and a USB and this thing comes standard on the scrambler as well as the adventure uh, you get a fitment for the roadster you can see over here that uh, these this screw so you can uh, buy this aftermarket or you can buy this from the uh, accessory store and you can just mount it you do not need to uh, cut any wires it's a coupler to coupler fitment they have given an option uh, somewhere around here somewhere inside where you can just plug it in if you want it and you can just remove it also if you just don't want it but having it is a good thing uh, these are the switch gears this is for your um, scrolling of your more well, actually you can see that you have the telltale lights on top again the cluster is similar to what you saw on the roadster beautiful color on the tank it's a dual tone color single piece seat again this seat is also very comfortable again like a scrambler and the best part is these exhaust that are present on either side now over here you see that uh, one exhaust on the roadster you see one exhaust is from this side and the other one is from this side but over here on the scrambler and on the adventure you have a single exhaust outlet and over here you have a split basically it's one into two so that is how it is and let me try to start it once this is how the motorcycle sounds so yeah and uh, this thing is also an uh, aftermarket fitment uh, aftermarket as in you can get it as an accessory this uh, comes all the way to here I mean there's a shorter thing like this is an extension so yeah you can get this looks pretty cool you have the tail light over here again LED and now let's talk about the power and the engine and the engine as I told you is the same it's a 334 cc single cylinder now the scrambler produces 29.1 PS of power and 28.2 Nm of peak torque and uh, <clears throat> again it's a air and oil cooled engine so coming to the price of the scrambler the scrambler is priced at 2.4 lakh X showroom and again you have a lot of color options and with the color options you the price increases slightly now last but not least let's come to the adventure now the now this is the yes the adventure and this looks absolutely amazing so if you can see uh, the roadster gets the alloy wheels the scrambler and the adventure gets these multi spoke wheels looks absolutely amazing now you get these mud guards again led indicators led headlight this is aftermarket this fly screen uh, i think it comes with the motorcycle and uh, you can see it it has jerry cans now this is completely loaded uh, with panniers and all of that but uh, this guard that you see over here this thing comes from factory you just need to buy these panniers and fit it on you don't have to buy this entire thing again after again an accessory accessory 
I'll just point out the accessories that are there. Uh, this pan is obviously accessories. Now you get one here also, and that one looks really cool. So the bike looks absolutely fantastic, and it looks very big when the third pannier is placed over here. It looks absolutely. It looks like an adventure to a motorcycle. You can see every adventure badging over here, and this thing features a single exhaust. The exhaust is canted upwards, but on this you can see that the console is slightly different because it has the turn by turn indication that is over here. So you can get this for all the motorcycles, and you can also get a Bluetooth uh, navigation system for the for the Scrambler as well as the Roadster. But those will be uh, an additional accessory. So on the Adventure you get this, and the best part about the Adventure is that you just loosen this up on either sides. and this screen will actually tilt you can see that this screen has a it, it can tilt up to 15 degrees so that's a really nice thing because some people if they are tall they maybe don't want the screen to be very straight so so you can see that this screen can go up or go down and this will give you better visibility and the readouts will be better so again after market accessory over here now this is standard as i told you Now coming to the engine specifications so the adventure is again a 334 cc single cylinder engine and this produces the maximum amount of power that's 30.2 ps and 29.9 nm of peak torque and talking about the pricing the adventure is priced at 2.9 lakh ex showroom and over here uh, you get now there is a camo shade also on this but that is again you'll have to order it it's made to order it's basically the tank will be khaki color and there will be a uh, camo paint that will be uh, on the tank so basically they will hydro dip the tank and give it to you uh, that will be made to order the person who wants it can definitely go for it i think it will look absolutely fantastic on this motorcycle so yeah guys these were the sd motorcycles and uh, again the sd roadster the sd scrambler and the adventure comment below how do you like the motorcycle and which motorcycle you like the most i think for me i will go with the scrambler because this looks absolutely fantastic so you comment below and tell and let us know which motorcycle you like the most and what color would you like to see the motorcycle on and is the pricing correct for all these motorcycles so please mention it on the comment section and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up share and subscribe to all the social media channels i'm prameet signing out see you next time thank you so much for watching take care and be safe